I told you we had more than enough to get it done. No hesitation. Shoot your shot. Oh, no, they got football. Everything we work for. Every guy in here doing everything they can to lean into a guy next time. The good things are going to happen. Harry Bynum and his dance were crazy good in that win, but he's also been a great representative of his heritage. He is Filipino through and through, and while his wife awaits a visa to see him play an NFL game in person, he is making a huge impact supporting his friends and family in the Philippines. For me to be able to represent the Philippines and the NFL is huge, especially the past few years being able to go back to the Philippines and really see where my family comes from. And one thing about Filipino culture, all the food is really what brings people together. Right here, we got the lumpia. We're cutting the garlic and the onions for our chicken adobo. And this is something that I was raised on in one of my favorite meals. Everything I do. For me to be able to represent the Philippines and the NFL is huge, especially this past few years, being able to go back to the Philippines and really see where my family comes from. And one thing about Filipino culture, all the food is really what brings people together. Right here, we got the lumpia. We're cutting the garlic and the onions for our chicken adobo. And this is something that I was raised on in one of my favorite meals. Everything I do on the field has the ability to change thousands of people's lives over in the Philippines. Find a Faith Foundation started knowing that there's not a lot of publicity for all the disasters that happen out in the Philippines. See all the destruction from the landslide and the typhoons. This is a whole neighborhood right here. I want to be able to inspire people and bring hope where there is no hope. It means a lot, you know, to be able to just use Cam's platform and make an impact in people's lives. We've done a lot of relief efforts so far, but the main thing has been helping the typhoon victims. Being the kid in the Philippines, first we start with um, sharing the Gospels. We want them to not be fed just physically, but be fed spiritually. Camp BZ has been a really big thing for the football community in the Philippines. Um, ever since the camp, we've grown the community like crazy. I think we really sparked the love for the game of football, and it excites me knowing that we will see a lot more Filipinos in the NFL in the years to come. Shout out to all my titas and titos that have taught me how to cook this. One thing about Filipinos, they always do the most when it comes to supporting their people. This past week, I get two interceptions and have the game of my life with my support system there to watch me. That's everything. When my family and yours, when I have to sit around my I love it. And this week, he is allowed to wear the Filipino flag on his helmet, representing his country and making them all very proud. All right. As we mentioned, a full slate of games today. So let's go. We're going to go rapid fire on this one. Mike, I want to start.